Jay Yo, so I got Jay Style coming up. And y'all don't know who Styles is, do you? Y'all see Timo? Yeah, you know who Styles was. He was the one who, who was like, my brother Stash is in the garage somewhere. And then Jay Fox like turns into a werewolf and he thinks he's gonna come out of the closet. So it's this whole thing. So hopefully this guy's not gonna come out of the closet. But I'll tell you where he is coming from. This cat's from Alamogordo. I met this young cat at a party, and this guy is sick. So, like, seriously, like, if you show love for no one else, give, give it up. Just give it up, because he's going to give you all he's got. Pretend we're no different than science men who play deceptive overtures on infinite dimension strings. Once we were still just first stoned and, and giggling at our hands, projecting in high definition something akin to dreams on small town doldrums, lonely blue mailbox, green paint, brown girls. You see, there's this, this terrible awareness that demands of us anxiety or arrogance or both, which is after all what we must call art. But these things and others are not grand enough or the proper distance from it or engulfed and eulogized by it. You'll have to excuse me. I have become other than myself. I have gone fishing in an attempt to approximate God and when I return, I'll owe me an apology. Sorry. Sorry. misfire self and rode square into a mad blank and Midwest oblivion where no one knew his name or that it was his name and the prayer he'd whispered at the occasion of his birth. The passenger people all have same intention tickets for the ride, but his says only further, which is a place he felt when he was young. A not too far white dwarf glow floats up from a team of leashed fireflies who pull the bus into the flat earth night, while Parrish sinks more and more through taupe suit anonymity, sinking below teen girl stares and old men's heads and, and the breast inside a baby's mouth just across the aisle, sinking below the vinyl seats until his head hangs deep in the gangway valley between them, hangs like a drunken boat in the calm cross-country river called Greyhound. The baby relaxes from its teeth bends its head like an invincible white owl and levels its unimpeachable eyes at Parrish gently as if to shout, hey, pay no heed the driver's striking resemblance to a virtual of the comedy. 
There's no designs in our destination, which explains the jazz addicts and whores following us there. <laughs> Speak easy and step lightly about what you find, Daddy O. We're pioneers to historians and, well, mad men to the rest of us. To which Parrish responds by pursing his lips, clasping them around the exposed teeth across the aisle, and sucking against the mother's writhes and wails while old men scoff to obscure smirks and all the girls erupt into an, oh shit, no, he did go print. Chorus, complete with head cocks, ass shakes, and finger snaps. Silhouetted as the bus slows behind a team of fireflies disappearing in the wide flood of dust. <laughs> Mozart's Requiem in my blood. Malt's colored milk blessing on my tongue. Ultimate bolts of stone dull and immobilized. Glad stuff makes bones itch and hands afraid to scratch. So bodies must be draped by blankets of tranquil from old blameless girls of addicts who, like one last breath jazz riff, blows until she squelches herself out of existence. You see, El Paso nights are righteous villainy. Small breast girls and knee-high socks with joints. Monuments to youth when sin was still just learning. Middle-aged and deviant suffocate more than trailer park hands, and Texas is too big a state to leave for all the drunken stupors and crank come downs, for all the slaps and shoves and misplaced prods, for all the knives and guns owned by boys too yellow to kill. The slow assassinations left to me. Puddle steps and stumbling through high heels. Midnight dark and highway between death and Denny. Humble glances through a bed of trash. Empty beer bottle regret pillowing anxious brows. All busy praying for God to exist in the mightiest way. All furled as lips pout in mother's absence. And bodies regress.